So you've been testing a girl for a while now and you want to know whether she likes you or not. The fact is most guys make things complicated by analyzing and making unnecessary judgment, checking out how many emojis she used as compared to yours, checking whether she's responding to other people's messages on social media, comparing the length of her messages to yours, and checking how many times she started a conversation versus how many times you have started, and a lot of other dumb shit like that. Guys, 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 this is not difficult. You can easily find out whether she likes you or not just by following these three steps tried and tested and guaranteed to work. Step 1. Text her. Would you like to hang out sometime? Sounds easy, right? Yeah. But this is the catch. If she likes you, she will reply when or simply say yes. If she doesn't like you, the answer is no. If a girl likes you, she would love to hang out with you no matter what. So the question is, what if she's busy with work or doing shit that girls like to do? Well, if she is, she would probably say something along the lines of, I would love to, but Sunday and Tuesdays are out. Some girls might test you, I would love to, but I'm busy. Such a test message means, go fuck yourself. I'm never hanging out with you, not in a million years. Makes you wonder, why would a girl send me messages when she doesn't actually like me? Among other things like painting nails and visiting the salon, girls love to chat when they are bored. She probably responded to your messages because she doesn't want to be socially awkward. So the fact that she responds to your messages doesn't mean she actually likes you. Step 2. When she finally agrees to go with you, make the move. What the fuck is make the move? Well, take your conversation to a new level, I mean. This is where you need to use all your psychological questions to make her like you more. I've made a video on things to speak about with any girl. Check it out. The link to that is in the description below. Step 3. Invite her over. Listen carefully. You don't want to ask a girl a question like, would you want to spend a night at my place? Unless she's a whore, you can get away with such a dumb question. Instead, you might want to say something in the lines of, I really had fun the last time. I want to cook something for you. Do you have anything in mind? Don't worry, it's on me. I've used this question about 10 times and it filled me only once. The girl was an asshole. So rest assured, this question is guaranteed to work. That's it guys, have fun and tell me if any of these questions worked for you. I'm reading your comments down there. It's been nice sharing this with you once again, your boy is Mass and Flick. Catch you in the next one. Peace.